I always want somebody with their eyelash looking like this. Let's leave this, this, let's leave that in 2021, okay? Do me that favor. Don't be walking around with your eyelashes looking like this. Please, don't do it. Don't do it, okay? <laughs> What's going on, everybody? Did you see the creative mogul? So, first step number one is we're going to be prepping the eyebrows. We're going to use an eyebrow pencil, shape them up, make them look cute. Next, we're applying the e.l.f. makeup remover just to clean them up a little bit. Now, we're going to apply the concealer to the eyebrows to give them a much more sharper look. And we're just pretty much taking our sweet pickle time so they can come out right. So I actually had uh, a MAC eye primer. I don't know the exact name. I know the brand is from MAC and I had got a sample. So I'm just pretty much, because I don't want to have a, a crease with my eyeshadow, just going to prime the eyelids. I'm just going to add a base color. My whole uh, look for this is going to be like space but like natural and the eyeshadow palette I'll be using is the LA colors this is a natural nude mix we're taking the concealer and we're just gonna do a quick little cut crease and then from there we are going to be adding the second color from the eyeshadow palette the third color from this eyeshadow palette, we're going to just pretty much like line over that cut crease and then we're going to make it look um, more defined. Now I'm going to apply the e.l.f. concealer. I'm going to put it under the eyelids and I'm going to use my beauty blender and just blend the concealer going up the eye, on top of my forehead, under the chin, and just pretty much just blending it. Now, I also like the Maybelline concealer. This is the number 35. This one is a little tad lighter than the other concealer. I just like to put that on the outer corners of the eyes so it can just give it like um, a bright highlight.
Next, we are going to be using the foundation. This is going to be a airbrush flawless foundation. And then after, we're gonna literally like drench our face with the foundation. <laughs> and then we're going to use our foundation brush. And we're not going to actually brush the foundation on our skin. We're going to just gently just pat just pat the foundation brush with the foundation on our face. One of my favorite makeup products is the highlighter. It's, I don't know how to explain it. It just makes the look look like, hey, like. <laughs> so I use that as my favorite color, the one that's on the left side. I just put that for the inner corner of the eyes and for the nose. And then I just put a little bit more concealer for under the eyes and then I'm going to use my beauty blender again and just blend that just to pretty much perfect the look. But I have lashes you choose. Like, it doesn't matter where you're from the lashes. I know for myself, I'm going for a dramatic lash. These are, I don't even know where these are from. But I'm going to go with these. So with your eyelashes, I don't even know if you can even see them. So first thing, first thing you do with any eyelash is you pick what eyelash you want. It could be dramatic lash, it could be regular lash it can also be ultra dramatic but not so so type of lash whatever lashes you decide to choose from that's your selection i know for myself i'm going to be doing a dramatic lash because it's new year's and i want to have that look okay so these are i do not remember where i got these from but I don't know where I got these from. So these are going to be the lashes. I'm just going to show you guys without dropping them. How can I? Hmm. So these are going to be the lashes I'm going to be wearing. I'm going to be wearing these. I'm going to put it to our eyelid. The ending to the forward and we're just gonna measure it to see and it's up by just doing this technique right here just do this to the lash I don't know if you guys can see it I'm wearing all black all black everything everything so I'm gonna do this to the lash and now we're just gonna bend it the lash to be a little bit more flexible the flare the secret of beauty this comes out comes out gray but it goes it dries black maybe only a little bit people they go like that mm -hmm. why are you looking at this lash you can tell that this side look and then we are going to <laughs> apply the lash so I always apply outward in well, this is not even complete yet but here is 
partially halfway done look. I have to complete with a nude lip with a gloss. And I'm also going to do like a, a silver. I'm going to do a silver for the eyelid. This is the look. Just want to wish you guys something but abundance and blessings for the new year. Thank you for watching. Connect with me on Twitter, Instagram, and Amazon. Thanks for watching.